guys, it's Will King here from My Cotton Homes. We're here in St. Florine, Alabama in the Stonegate neighborhood. I'm here with Kevin and Christine Jackson. Uh, Kevin and Christine came to us back in December of last year, had some plans drawn from their architect, and we were able to work with those guys and get all the details worked out. I think we started construction in March of this year, and here we are today. It's move-in day. We finally got this one punched out, so we're going to take you guys through and give you a look. So what do you guys think? We love it. I mean, I think one of the coolest things in your kitchen really is your nine-foot window that you have. This natural light and your light fixtures are really cool. Thank you. That's like the best highlight of the kitchen I think we've ever done. And having all your pantry space is awesome. It's just basically an extension of your kitchen. It is an extension. That's what I designed it for. And I'm glad that we ended up not putting a door here. Yes. And there's no upper cabinets, so you've got in the kitchen very little. But you've got all the storage Plenty area of storage out there. of sight in the pantry. So, and you have the massive refrigerator for the whole family to enjoy. Yes, four boys. That we was have big, to have a lot of fridge space. Huge decision. I feel like we should talk about Jenny. She's my stove. So Jenny is a Gen Air, 48 inch range. So it's going to be really nice to have that to cook for everyone. It clean. It cooks by itself. I think is the is the cool part about Jenny. She's she's magic. She's magic, yeah. but she doesn't clean. No, no. That's very right. unfortunate. <laughs> Let's see, how long have we been building? Seven months? I think it took eight months to decide your fireplace color. Yes. Yeah. It turned out great though. I love the ship lap. Let's talk about the master bath. Your mirrors turned out great. Yes, I'm so glad we went with the 30 inch wide mirrors. Those and are so pretty. The way the black cabinets pop with your floor is really, really cool. And how neat's the LED lights behind your glass doors? So cool. We were worried about making that work, but it actually looks really good. I know, I'm so really, glad. Really I think it looks great. Cool. And your master shower has the transom above it. So you can now take steam. Steam or showers. No steam. Oh, it's so beautiful. And the wonderful bathtub that we we moved twice to twice. get it just right. But it fits perfectly in the space now, and it is so beautiful. Yeah, let's go look at the guest bathroom. I really like the the back tile. It's brick pattern on the sides, and then a herringbone across the herringbone, back. Herringbone, yes, it looks very good. That was a big decision. It was a big decision. A lot of work went into that. It's really pretty. With the niche. Yes. So. Awesome. Let's go look at the dining room. How about this? This one's Is really it gold or is it brushed brass? It's brushed brass. The landing of your stairs turned out really cool. The bookshelf made the whole space really, really neat. I'm really glad that we decided to add this. And the natural wood ceilings. So what room is this, Christine? This is the playroom for the kids. And... This is one of my favorite features in this room is the light that we had the electricians hardwire. It is the light that was in Kevin's childhood bedroom. And Wendy. the kids found it at their grandmother's and, and insisted it that it go in their playroom. And well, they I'm glad we were able to hang it up for them. This is going to be a neat space. I absolutely love the play spaces the on play the side spaces. that we teed and cooled. That's got carpet in it. They can draw on the walls destroy it and you'll never see it. Has light there, so they love those. It's a great way to use that knee space in an attic just to go ahead and just finish, finish it out. out. Yep. So this is the kids' bathroom, one of the kids' bathrooms, right? Yes. And the black tile in here is really, really neat. The slanted ceilings make the whole space kind of cool. So this is um, the Jack and Jack. We're calling it the Jack and Jack bathroom. And we decided to do a separate tub shower because our boys are still little and they like to take baths in the master and that is my space. Well, and you have four kids, so now yes, so. you can actually have dual, dual baths going at one time here to get everybody ready for bed. And the tile selection um, was just something that we found at Lowe's that we yeah. liked. So. So, Christine, one of my favorite things in this house is the fact that you have a laundry chute. 
That's something that I have not seen since my great grandmother's house when I was a little boy. But I think having it in your house is such a neat feature. Very convenient for your kids. Maybe they can actually get their dirty clothes to the hamper now. It is a convenience feature, but it's also just a really cool feature. <laughs> Everybody wants a laundry sheet. Why would you not want a laundry sheet? It's perfect. Uh, Kevin actually showed me um, High Cotton's Facebook page back probably last October or mm -hmm. November, and he showed it to me a couple times, and I was just really disinterested, honestly, at the whole building process at the time. And then he showed me that High Cotton offered this accounting software that would allow you to budget everything and track your budget called co-construct and that sold me right away but then I had to make sure that they knew what they were doing so I loved all of their projects that were online yeah, and most of the other builders would you, you would give them a price and say yeah we can do it for that much but they didn't really tell you what you were getting or to what extent your house would build so I think that was a, a good choice for us so yeah the feature the added feature of knowing your budget by line item and knowing the cost of everything when it happened was really appealing and really worked really well throughout the whole building process. I think my most favorite thing is this kitchen, specifically the pantry. I th it's just so wonderful. It's an extension of the kitchen. It's so much storage. I just love it, everything about it. I think my favorite feature is the bathroom and the closet. The master bathroom? The master bathroom, the master closet, yes. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. Tell us what your favorite part of the house is. Uh, my bathroom. Your bathroom? Why do you like your bathroom so much? Because I have a jetted tub. A jetted tub. That's really cool. How about your shower? Uh -huh. <laughs> awesome. Can I just say our contractor is better than your contractor? <laughs> Guys, thank you so much for watching our video. If you or your family is interested in building with us, just feel free to give us a call. Uh, you can check our website out at highcotton-homes.com. We're also on Facebook and Instagram and now Pinterest. Uh, our, our office number is 256-281-1626. Thanks for watching, guys.